mention the world fasting and most lifter picture their hard-earned muscle melting away. It's often seen as a trick for losing weight, not for building a better body. But what if that idea is not just old school, but actually holding you back? What if strategic fasting could help you get leaner and more muscular efficiently than you thought ever possible? Here are the seven benefits that you will experience for sure. First of all, when you go into the fasting state after, I would say, 6 to 12 hours, you get this metabolic switch. And then simply your body shifts from burning sugar to burning fat for fuel. And this is idle for cutting. It does straight for the store the body fat. Who doesn't like to be lean and muscular, of course, at the same time? And this is the phase one that happens when you start fasting. Number two is the body switches into the ketosis and that's high octane fuel. That means then the body after, I would say, approximately three days starts burning your own fat for sure as energy source. And even if you want it or not, and by the way, when you really start getting into that ketosis, what I personally experience is that your brain finally switches and you're, you're getting much more energy, you're becoming stronger and you're becoming way more mentally sharper. And this happens approximately after three days. Again, if you're doing your fasting properly, because ketones that occur are clean fuel for both brain and the body. You will really feel that you're getting steadier energy, better focus, and for sure increased fat burning potential during the training. Number three is AGH spike. So don't, of course, expect that it will be like taking synthetical somatropin or, you know, growth hormone. But you will feel that, you know, during fasting, the human growth hormone, AGH, level rise. You won't, of course, build new muscle alone, but it really helps preserve the muscle that you already have. And that's, let's be honest, a key factor for all the lifters. And you will feel it. Trust me on that one. By the way, if we didn't met, my name is Boris Kish. I'm an IBB certified fitness coach, nutritionist, and super heavyweight competitor in the category over 100 kilograms. Welcome to my channel. If you like content like this, please hit that like and subscribe button because this will really help me to grow because my channel is brand new and I will really appreciate it for sure. Number four, autophagy, cellular cleanup. This is the thing that a lot of people are not talking about and this is the most important thing if you ask me by my opinion because this is really like changing an oil on the car you know after 48 hours out of foggy kicks in and then your body starts really recycling you know breaking down old damaged cells and of course cancerogenic tumor cells yeah you start eating your own dead cells which is, again, extremely important that you don't get cancer later on in your, in your life. And even early on, you know, ex it, this can really occur. Let's be honest, how much shit are we putting in our side, inside our bodies that has nothing to do with bodybuilding and fitness. But whoever is in bodybuilding and fitness, especially if you're taking pads, like I was and like I am, you know, this is like a nuclear bomb. Never, You never know, you know, what you stored in your body and what can go wrong. And this is why fasting is really important because you will eat those cells, you will reduce the inflammation and the body will be functioning way more better. And with healthy body that doesn't have that shitty dump inside, Fat burning process will go much faster and of course muscle building process. I mean this is simple logic. And this also plays a huge role in fighting inflammation, aging and as I said even every kind of cancer research is still 
ongoing. But just think logically, this is what must happen. Number five is mass loss. Only if you mess it up, studies are showing that if you hit your protein and calorie targets inside your eating window, you won't lose more muscle than someone on a regular diet. You know, fasting is not supposed to be your enemy. Under eating is that this basically means that if you, you know, eat in that one meal that you're supposed to have during the day, all your proteins, all your carbs, all your fats, you're not going to lose anything. You know, yes, of course, this is not the ideal way for, you know, muscle hypertrophy. That's for sure, but you will not lose anything. And the main goal of doing this is recycling the system, as I explained, because, you know, healthy system will burn fat five times faster and build muscle for sure. Number six is training while fasting. You know, how you're supposed to be heavy lifting, how you're supposed to be fully energized and how you're supposed to be motivated if you're eating once per day. Well, this is really actually extremely simple. Be smart and do it in a smart way. And that means do it after a meal inside your eating window. Understand, you know, do it like two hours after you have that meal and that way you will still be, you know, destroying everything in the gym. It's as simple as that. And when you start your fasting, just start with light cardio or pump work to see how the body is adapting. But I personally never had any problems. You can go full power all the way. Number seven, let's get a little bit into the mindset. Hunger doesn't kill you. Weakness does. Fasting doesn't just train your body, okay? It sharpens your mind. When you learn to sit down with hunger and not to panic, you become really dangerous, my friend. Everyone can eat six times a day like a maniac, you know, but not everyone can stay calm in that Zen mood. Like Miyamoto Musashi, the Japanese master samurai, and really, you know, stay calm when the brain screams for food. If you're able to survive this state, you will be able to survive and control everything in life. And if hunger hits while you're fasting, don't freak out. Click right here. In that video, I break down the exact supplements that help you push through the fast like a machine. I'll see you there now.